Did you know that more than 80% of farm workers vaccinated animals accidentally stuck themselves with a needle? Needle stick injuries are usually minor, but they can be serious, causing skin infections, allergic reactions, or deep tissue wounds that require surgery. With a few simple precautions, you can prevent needle stick injuries. The most important thing you can do is slow down, do not rush, and take the time to practice a few simple steps. Restrain animals properly. Use the correct equipment and techniques and get help from co-workers. Do not use your mouth for uncapping or recapping needles. Discard bent or dull needles. Do not try to straighten or reuse them. Don't keep needles or syringes, used or unused, in your pockets. Nearly half of needle stick injuries occur after the injection or during disposal. To prevent these injuries, always use an approved sharps container. Keep the container close by so you can dispose of needles immediately. Avoid recapping needles. Recapping leaves your hands vulnerable to accidental needle stick. Ideally, use the one hand scoop yep. technique. And that works in a lab. If you do get stuck, stop what you're doing and immediately wash the skin with soap and water. Report the injury to your supervisor and call your healthcare provider. It's a good idea to practice these precautions every day. But please, take extra care when injecting the following drugs. Thylmycosin, sedatives, oil-based products or vaccines, RB51 vaccine, any modified live vaccine, Jones vaccine and antibiotics. Hormones also require extra care, and pregnant women should not do these injections. By taking your time and using these simple precautions, you will greatly reduce your risk of injury, so you can keep your operation running smoothly.